Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my Let's Play Total War Arena. Um, <clears throat> I did do a recent video on this, if you want to have a look it will be uh, in my description. But basically I wanted to show a full game of commentary on my own, um, so I won't be communicating with anybody else. Um, I'm just literally going into this game solo. Um, so yeah, we're going to take this as it comes. The game is nearly ready. Uh, so for those of you who are not aware of what Total War Arena is, Total War Arena is basically the battlegrounds of to the Total War franchise. Um, you get to choose a general um, who ha will have different abilities for your unit, and then you get three units. Um, you decide what they are, so whether they're swordsmen, spearmen, pikemen, cavalry, archers, javelin, etc. Um, as you can now see by the screen, it is a 10 versus 10 game, which I imagine will be quite difficult for a lot of people to play in a team environment in the future um, due to communication, but there are a lot of ways to uh, make that work. I've already thought of a few ways via TeamSpeak, which I'll go into when I start doing more sort of team orientated games. Um, however, we're about to go into the game, and this is, f I can't pronounce it, but this map has a the hot gates, which are basically here where I'm drawing on the map. Nice little colouring in there. These are the hot gates, uh, so it's a canyon. You can go up here, you can shoot down into that canyon. Um, just so everybody knows, you get these different spawn points. I'm going to go into three, and I'm going to show you the canyon. Um, I'm not going to be able to, sh in fact, you know what, I'm going to go to one and I'm going to hit the middle so that way I can sort of show you the flanks. The goal of the game is to either completely destroy the enemy or capture their base uh, by do doing this at the same time as defending your base. So there's a lot to be done in the game. There's only 20 minutes of the game time. So whoever who, whichever team has the most points at first basically wins the game. Um, if if you're not able to capture the flag or, or their base at the end. Um, so yeah, here we go. Ready or not, we're going. So I'm basically going to just move my units up. Um, I'm not exactly sure where everyone's going. Normally I played, I don't normally play this on my own. So uh, it's going to be interesting to see how people play. I mean, I've... I noticed that we've got a cavalry guy. If you hover over them, it actually shows you where the units are going to. That way you sort of get a better idea of what your allies are going to be doing. Um, so if we just have a look at the map, we've got a couple of catapults. They're going to do us a, you know, a good couple of favours. We've got some swordsmen coming into the middle here. Uh, cavalry hitting the flank. Some archers. Uh, that guy's all archers. Um, remember, you only get three units. So let's let's go back over to my boys. So basically, what my plan here is to move my units up into this bush line because if I let the archers get in there, these guys cannot push through the hot hot gates. So my job, in a way, is to stop the enemy from controlling the hot gates. Now, unfortunately, they've got some archers who I have now spotted, and I'm not sh sure whether or not I'm in range. Oh, and I've just taken a direct hit from catapults. Now, that hurt. I'm just going to move my units back because that hurt a lot, and I'm getting rained down. So, they are. Sc I can't help these guys down here now. I've got units charging in on me. In fact, I've got a lot, and... The, my cavalry is, is retreating. Um, as you can probably see, <laughs> the catapults do a lot of damage. This unit is it's half health. It's below half health. I've lost nearly half a unit. Um, uh, these guys are alright. These guys are alright. So, but I'm going to hold here now. I'm going to bring these behind my swordsman. And I'm going to pop triple which is a consumable you have to buy these but this is just i can't let these guys get through now so we're going to hit these guys they're getting hit by the catapults they're getting pushed back in fact he stopped 
and he has no range at all. So we're going to brace this charge. Unfortunately, I haven't even got war cry right now, and my guys are being flanked. Weapons ready. In fact, I think I'm about to get crushed, so I'm going to move my units Army. back. Unfortunately, my guys are rooting. There's no, there's no safety for them now. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do friendly fire. I've got no choice. It's not gonna hit me as hard as it's gonna hit the enemy, who are now chasing me, which is absolutely fantastic. I'm going to try and run my units away. However, this guy's quite low, so if I'm gonna try and focus my troops, I'm gonna pop parry, get a little bit of extra defense. Um, we've only got catapults here. We got cavalry charge, boom! Did you see that? That was a nice charge there, right into uh, the back of my enemy there. Um, unfortunately, I've got I've got no defence other than just letting them charge the catapult instead of me, which gives me an opportunity to give him a quick hit. I might even be able to get two before he removes his units. Yes, I will. Now we're going to move out. Come back to my unit here. Let's try and get him out of there. That's a mess. Let's move our units out. And he's backing off. So I'm going to go back on him. He's trying to take out our catapult. So let's, let's hit him. And then let's turn these units back in. We're going to get hit hard here. But... Parry. These guys, I got no units there. We're rooting already, but we killed a unit. We killed a Bye unit, enemy. so we haven't done as bad. <laughs> as this has not really gone well for me uh, for a let's play video, but this is how quick the game is. We're, it's a 20-minute game. We're 10 minutes in. I've nearly lost all my units. I'm probably going to lose all my units. I'm not. I, I'm not foolish enough to think that I won't <laughs> um, and yes yeah, so now I have lost all my units here however look at that fight the greens are his okay and some of the whites I'm blue and my units are blue so I did a fair amount of damage to them there and I'm hitting him here now he's taking casualties we're just trying to I'm just trying to do as much damage as I can because having a unit like this in my way is going to be tough. So he's got charge, so I'm getting the hell out of there. I have faster movement speed. However, I'm getting squished in now. Oh! Oof! I can't get out of that. I'm, I'm going to lose a couple of units, but I think I might be able to just about get... Okay, they're rooting, which is good. They're going to run now. They'll, they'll regroup. They'll regroup. So we have a look at the map. These guys are pushing up. These guys are fighting over here. It's getting quite tight. So, let's regroup this unit here. I want to position them as far away from my enemy as possible. We've got cavalry on the way. They're going to back us up. He's capping, but the cavalry are going to hit the infantry from behind, which is... He just charged. Okay, now he's turning in. We are going to hit him now. Can have a look in the battle. This is a dirty fight here. Oof. I would not want to be those guys, I'm telling you now. Alright, so I'm hitting. He's just popped his charge and actually done absolutely nothing. So, I've nearly killed one unit. He's got three men and he's rooting, which is actually perfect for me. So, let's try and get round to the cavalry. They're coming this way. We're positioning ourselves. Get that charge going, boys. I need that charge. Okay, he's, he's switching on to my, my, uh, cap, my allied catapult. So, let's hit him hard here. We've taken out three. One more throw. And then we're friendly firing, so it's not worth it. Watch for catapults. Yeah. Unfortunately, in fact, no, I do not want to attack them. I'm going to actually just send my troops 
straight over here now. He's got some guy here, gold apparently. I, d I, I don't know what that name thing means. I will be sure to try and find that out. Yeah. So where are we at? Where are we at? We're all the way back here. That's all I got left. I haven't even got one unit just that rooted or or anything like that. It's just that is the remainder of my troop. And then these little guys here. But if you look at the score at the top left and right, those are our units. We're very it's very close. Very close. Unfortunately, I think they're winning down here. I'm trying to flank them. He hasn't got many swords. He's got no backup. But our guys, I don't know who's hitting them in the ups. Ah, oh, shit! That's there a, is no time to lose. That's an enemy. So we got archers going in there to back him up. Here they are. Right, I need to get my units out of the way before he decides to shoot at them. Because I'm an easy target for him. To victory! However, I may well Move! I can get a hit on him. I can get a hit on Take him. Aim! He's not targeting me. He's just moving ah now I'm fucked. <laughs> now I'm fucked. I killed a fair amount of them, but I just lost a fuck ton. He's got a root. Don't run into him! Ah oh, It's all over Wow as I am completely dead, fifth, nearly well, 16 minutes into this game, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna show you the battlefield a little bit. So, we actually had three catapults. We've got one left. They were able to kill that one, and they were able to destroy. Uh, oh, I think he's over here. I destroy one here. So, f two of two out of three of our catapults went down. Um, they did come into our base with a couple of units, and as you can see, there's a few corpses. Those are my corpses littered around um, that we were able to take care of there's been a lot of fighting near our base a lot um, unfortunately well in fact where's them there? there should be more fighting around here there's some more here we have brought it to them now though uh, they obviously were hitting us we're now capturing the enemy base we have one unit inside there a spear against cavalry obviously Spearmen have, are better than cavalry uh, in terms of a straight up fight. This, you know, it's kind of like a pikeman. They're able to get their spears right up into the into the cavalry. So I'm hoping he can withstand the charges, but he's got to regroup his units correctly, otherwise he's going to be screwed. Um, if we're looking at people are moving up, we've got a lot of archers, a lot of archers left. Not much cavalry. More archers, a little bit of cavalry, more archers. Now he's got archers here. Um, we've got one cavalry unit. Shocking a ranged unit here, the javelin unit. Um, but yeah, he's about to get cornered in. And they've got a hell of a lot of archers here. However, they are very closely cramped together. And as you can see, we've got a charge into them. Shock the enemy. Okay, one of his units are rooting already. <laughs> Even though he's taken no damage, but unfortunately it was so low they just couldn't handle it. But you can just see the morale of the archers just drop, and then this spearman's going to hit in this archer trying to run away. He should be able to lock them in, maybe not. And he's now going to take a charge from behind, and yeah, that hurt. The enemy are regrouping nicely. Um, let's go back over to the left here. So we've got some archers going on. We're, we're, we're firing in there. I mean, that's what we're currently capping, which is giving us points. And points are winning the game. We've got more men. We're capping the enemy base. We do have a good opportunity to take this home. Um, so, yeah, the archers are, are pushing in. Got another unit of archers here. Just hitting them. But he's raised his shields. He can t withstand this. However, he <laughs> he's taking two hits. Catapult shot. More hits. I'm not seeing many of his men drop though. I think because of the how he's moving, he's somehow shields are raised. He's gonna make it out of there and he may hit our archers. 
And they've been slowed down. He, I repeat, they have been slowed down. That hill was great move by our, by our ally here. He's rooting. He's got a full squad rooting. Um, and that spear are just taking hit after hit after hit. But let's go back to the enemy base. We've got one unit in there. He's not capping because these guys are interrupting him. Now, one good thing about this game is if you have got archers outside of the base and you've got and your enemy is inside capping, you can hit them from outside, which will interrupt the cap, um, which gives you a better. Ch it's it's a good way of defending. Um, generally, a very good way of defending actually because you can keep some units. Uh, archers are quite fast moving. Um, I'm not sure if they're going to bring horse archers into the game or if they already have, but bloody hell, that will be fun. <laughs> um, so this battle is about to wrap up. We've got one more minute, 34 seconds. We're, st oh, we're very even on the, uh, the army front. We had about 80 men more a moment ago, and now we're losing in, t in terms of infantry by a few units, but... This unit's going to ta be taken out. The archers are just hammering and hammering them. Um, and eventually he's going to give up. I mean, he's, his men are going to run out of health. The archers have got the speed advantage. And they're winning that fight. So I'll just leave them to it. Where's the enemy? Okay, so we've got a spear unit coming around. There was archers around here. I'm not sure where they've gone. Uh, they're in the hidden territory. One good thing about this game is obviously because of all of this hidden territory you can hide in a sense from from the enemy um, but also it means that positioning is key you need you need to control the no map one. and you can take these towers which give you more vision over the game um, but if you move one unit out of that tower you lose that tower so you have to have a unit inside otherwise it, it doesn't work you also can see the points here now points are gained from what you do in the game I'm the Kaiser as you know and I did very shit I'm not looking forward to seeing how many men I killed but you can get a general gist of the points um, and you can kind of see that we are going to win this game um, just just on the points it, and we got more men. But yeah, victory. Um, Commander XP, unit XP, turtle income. Boom. Done. Job done. Now let's have a look at how shit I really did in that game. Right. So points. Apparently I came third. I didn't have the same amount of points. Now I'm not entirely sure why I'm third. I actually have no idea. I don't know how that works. It could be because of the XP I've gained or or the kills I got. I'm not 100%. But if you look at the kills, I only got 131. So I didn't really do a great deal. Um, pff, I, I don't know. I lost every single man. Pretty much. <clears throat> I think I deployed about 275. So yeah, I, I pretty much lost every single man. Um... But yeah, that, that's it then. That is the game, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you enjoyed my video. Um, you know, if you did like the video, please like, uh, subscribe and comment. Um, if you're watching this on Twitch, which by the way, this has come from Twitch for you guys on YouTube. Um, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video uh, and enjoyed the stream. And, you know, get, get involved. Come chat to me. Um, and those who are watching on YouTube, get onto my stream. Let's, you know, come come chat. Let's work together. Teach me, and I'll teach you. We'll work together. Well, thank.